Hi. In the beginning, <coughs> I want to ask you a few questions. Let's wait. You mustn't answer it out loud. Only think. So, my first question is, who did you want to become in childhood? And what do you think about it now? My third question is, what job will you choose in the future? Or if you have had job already, do you really like it? I think the first question was easiest and third hardest. Especially for teenagers, but I think for some grown up people too. If the third question was not difficult for you, lucky you are. I'm going to give a talk about finding yourself in this big world. Have you heard about Elon Musk? At least you must saw him in the memes. Uh, so he suggests a new form of education. He made his own school that called Ad Astra. By the way, in Latin there is a phrase per aspera ad astra that means through difficult to the stars. So he offer no scale of marks. He offer uh, a special currency for evaluation of students' works. Also, what is most important for my TED talk, that he offer show students what they like to do, their hobbies. I'll explain. For example, if you're a musical person, you can choose more music lessons in your timetable. The school will not kill your mental health. The school will really help you to find your dream job. Dream job, what it means for you? Uh, you must answer it just a rhetorical question like free before. Uh, so I have one scheme. Uh, I saw this in, on the internet. Uh, how you see, there are uh, three areas that you can do that brings you sparks joy or brings you good feelings and that someone needs. Hobby it is that you can do and what brings you good feelings. Work is combination of that someone needs and uh, you can do. And the last one, charity, it is that someone needs and brings you good feelings. To sum up, in the middle we will have this wonderful area that call dream job. So if we have this scheme, how we can find a dream job, what prevent us to do this? I think this scheme is not enough for this. You can do this checklist and work with all areas. You can write what matter for you uh, in all these areas. Uh, you can write what can you do, what brings you good feelings, and what, uh, in your opinion, people need. Uh, so we have this scheme, we have this checklist, but why people have problems with finding themselves? Maybe fears? Ordinary school brings us so many fears. Russian magazine Medusa wrote that in all world, 35% students uh, been pulled in the school. Also, Russian magazine Argumenty i Fakty wrote that 30 to 35% of students have problems with health after admission to the school. These facts really affect in motivation and finding yourself. I think if we start improve the situation with attitude to teens, we will have more talented and bright people. I'll explain. I have another scheme. Uh, how you see, if we do this first point, we will have this as a result. Uh, if we start to attitude teens well, start to understand their problems and help them find themselves, they will grow up like are people without problems with mental health. At least they will understand their abilities. Uh, so we have an example of education, how we can uh, educate the people who will understand their place in this big world. Also, we have Elon Musk, like example of a uh, person who really cares uh, about teens' problems and want to reform our education. 
Now we're a generation at the fork of the future and we can start to change our system and we can find ourselves in this wonderful world. I wish you good luck. Thanks.